Hey guys and welcome back to the Maelstrom Vanilla server where today we are going to work on a very nice room. Um, as you can see stuff has been worked on at spawn. I have no sound again, I don't know why. Um, Samir decided to make us a lovely sugarcane farm. And I remember what I was doing here now. Get me all the way. Come on. Breaking wheat legs, apparently. I like how there's arrows everywhere in this thing. But I remember why I was here now. I'm actually going to abuse that sugarcane farm real quick as well. Okay, I have the wheat that I need. Okay, and boop. And this uh, sugar can farm is all thanks to Samir the Knight. So you guys can give a big thanks to him. Um, my sound is really low. There we go. I can hear things again. Okay, so someone's growing jungle wood. I can tell that much. Um, let me eat some bread. Someone's building the Tower of Sauron over there. Sauron or Saruman, whichever one. First, let me check real quick. Yeah, we don't have that much leather in there. Wait a second. Get the fuck out of my inventory. Breed all the cows. And then we're gonna kill all the adult cows. I don't know how many that is. But it is going to be so worth it. Which door is this? Nope. Yeah, we want to use this one. Oh yeah, look at all that leather. That's gonna give us 15. No, it's not gonna give us 15. It'll give us roughly 10 bookshelves. Which I have what I mean, I can make it here. So let's go do that real quick. Smear's house right over there. Freeze little humble abode. Haven't been here in a while. That's wheat. Actually, I'm gonna turn this into bread. So I have more food. Um, sugar cane. I'm just gonna turn it all into the paper. So I can have. There we go. And books. Yeah, let's just turn all of that. Bam. Yeah, it gave us exactly ten like I said. Okay, um we need this book piece. We need that obsidian and then we need all of this down all this goodness down here do 
I'm lagging me right now, but computer. There you go. Table table. Now I'm gonna cut right here, and then when we get back to the base, I'm going to uh, start recording again. So back in a bit, guys, because I have to go through a thousand blocks. Uh, like, okay, we're back, and you guys are gonna be a little surprised, I guess, from last episode to this episode, with the amount of pr oh, stupid like from getting out of the portal, with the amount of progress that's happened with my house. Well, my new area of baseness. Oh my god, what's with this lag? Okay, done lagging. Bring it down to eight chunks. Okay, it's somewhat stopped the lag. But we're gonna go over here. There's the little house area entrance. Farms like you guys remember. Nether brick, nether brick, nether brick. Motherfucker. Now I put another brick in here. I think I put another brick in here. Yeah. Okay, we're gonna go in here. Now I took down this area. Like I said, I would have moved all this. I did the border areas of the house, so it's a little bit cleaner. Um, I got this done. This is my chest room, my storage room. It's gonna be really big, and what I'm doing is whatever I want s frames on the sides uh, so much like then we come over here and bam this is my potion room and stuff that's what it's gonna be it's really in a work in progress over here I'm gonna have enchanted to right here I think it's a nice little area I might do the floor out of glass I'm not 100% sure might do a, a nether brick stair rim around it so that's what I'm planning to do over there so let's get some supplies real quick and we'll test it out let me see how many stairs do I got? I have 26 nether brick stairs 9 nether brick and more now that we're coming out of here, I'm gonna make some more stairs. Yeah, I was only one away from another set of stairs, so I'm gonna make another set of stairs. I forgot the glass. Derp, derp, derp. Now, I don't want it to be just a square room. I mean, I could just make it a square room. Uh, seeing how it is and everything. Let's see real quick. I do want this to be the entrance. Okay, so I need to go one more out this way. Whew. And then could do this. And then a glass. Fuck you. Actually, 
like that and then the bookshelves around it that way it keeps with the whole entire tree theme but slightly hovered I like that idea and then we just put our bookshelves around it and then we just need one two uh, stupid leg one two three four five and this will be done okay so I like how this is coming along I'm gonna move the nether uh, wart room if I could stop lagging uh, nice coffee yeah and then I could just use this all around but that would defeat the purpose of the glass actually no it wouldn't it, it wouldn't def mm. it kinda does so I guess what I would do is take the nether brick I would start right there and then continue it around like so Do I have enough to actually go all the way around? That'd be pretty awesome. I think I might have enough to go all the way around. And then what I might do with the rest of the nether brick is make another uh, brick fence. There we go. Oh my god, this lag is killing me. Game, what are you doing to me? That sounds. Stop it. Let's go. No particles at the moment. And I'm still lagging. I'll be right back, guys. Well, I might have to restart the game and everything, so be right back real quick. Okay. The lag seemed to have cleared up a bit. So that's good. Um, let us go back. Actually, I'm going to make the border right now with this, because I can do a border. Whoa, whoa, staircase, no. Bad staircase. I can make a rough border for now with this. Cause I still want to be able to walk around the glass and everything, see the glass. I like that feeling. It feels like it's up above. What I might do is to fill in these corners, put uh, that. That way it's all smoothed. I'm not even clicking up there. What the hell? But I'm gonna do something along the lines of this. Let me just put that in that corner. Let me see how much uh, nether brick we have at the moment. Because it's friggin' expensive doing this stuff with nether rack and uh, nether brick. Because you don't get that much yield from it, anyways. So it's kind of like. It's gonna fill up these three. Boop, boop. Okay. There we go. Okay. So they give me that, and this will give me 16. And, yep. Okay. That should be all the fence we need at the moment. Because, let me see, we you didn't use up all the stairs, so we shouldn't need all that much fence. Because I want to try and keep it open. To be honest, I like this open feeling. Oh yeah, we're going to need more fence. Let's 
let's see, one, two, three, four, five. You only need five, so that's not that bad. But I know nowhere near enough nether brick was cooked by this time. So, also, I've had this pickaxe, uh, not pickaxe, axe since the beginning of the game pretty much. It has not broken yet, it is still holding strong. I love it. Oh, we have plenty of nether brick actually. I didn't realize we had the four. So, I just need to boop, boop. And. Come on. I'm gonna sleep. Before stuff starts spawning. Whew. Also, I'm gonna move my bed from here because. Uh, it always gives me the warning there are enemies nearby when they're under me and everything, and I'm safe. It doesn't register the fact that there's uh, blocks intersecting. So I need to move that and hopefully find a better place. I'm going to do it a little bit higher um, because as I go around, I'm going to circulate. Because, see, it went up over here. I'm going to have it go up over here now into another layer slash floor type deal yo there we go that is now done and do I have I don't know why those are in two different sets but okay sure Hello, Vanny. Um, boop. Let's see. Okay, so I'm going to cut the recording real quick, and when I get to his place, I will be there. <laughs> Alright guys, be right back. Okay guys, we're finally at Vanny's portal. He doesn't have his track finished, so it's kind of hard to get to his place now to find Vanny. Let's see. Um, okay, I'll build this. It's very nice. Oh, dear God. So he's that way. Okay, and let's see if we can see Vanny. Motherfucker. The creeper. 
So he's coming from the desert, Vanny. Me, no. Not taking part in this. I'm running. Nope. Check Testa. But yeah, they have like a. This looks really cool over here and everything. So. Uh, I didn't get any arrows. Then I'm gonna didn't kill a skeleton. Okay, that's a zombie down. That's not a skeleton. I want a skeleton. Because this is infinite, yes. That's two creepers. Never mind. Run away. Where is Annie? I do know he has also built an aim. Okay, there's Vanny. Come on, let me sleep. No! Pig! Get pig! No! Pig! Pig! Fell on Vanny. Probably gonna take us that portal that I, I saw right over here. Yep. Oh man. Can't wait to see what's in here. Oh my god, that is so cool. <laughs> Distracted by stained glass. Skeleton spawner. Ooh, I almost hit him. So they got the skeleton spawner. Oh wow, they cleared out a lot of that mine shaft. I'm gonna grab those boat arrows. Okay, similar design to the one at spawn. Oh, this is pretty. This is cool. It's cool. Uh, I like the nether brick over here. How it kind of melts into it. Okay. Got some melons. Let's see. Gonna go up. Is this where he has his mob drop farm? Cause I know he was building a mob dropper. And oh my god, yes it is. Bastard. Holy crap. There's the iron farm. And up there's the mob dropper. Oh my god. He really did go all the way up. Blah. Blah blah. Blah blah. So don't don't you you
damn it. King of the Ladder, Extreme Edition. No, you. First, was wondering because he he was shooting at me first. Uh, I have to go get my stuff now. Yep, <laughs> that was recorded all right, and it's staying in. That's all eight of my levels. Oh man. Such a shame. Let me just go grab my stuff real quick. Oh, Creeper exploded here. There we go. I got my stuff. Let's see. So this is the iron farm. It goes down underground. I just want to see how much iron they've collected as of now. Let's see. I need some food. Nom 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 nom. That's not iron. This is iron. Oh wow. That's a nice amount of iron. That's only one tier. Holy crap. Go AFK here for like an hour or two. Damn, you got some iron. Now, while he's. Where did I get a bow? Let's go up here real quick. And shake around my iced coffee, which is a block of ice right now. Melt, please, I want more coffee. Now, this is a. You guys remember the mob dropper I had on Maelstrom Season 1? 2? Yeah, season 2, I think. I don't remember. I built a mob dropper. Uh, I built a lot of mob droppers, but... I built uh, one based off the snowflake design of Etho, where it's about... I think it's... 8... 12 spawning pads per layer. Roughly, I think that's what this is. And as you can see, it all drops into there. We it spawns witches now, so that's gonna be amazing. Hey, pod, yeah! <laughs> oh, witch didn't. Which died. But witches, they'll drop that. <laughs> you now exist to YouTube again. <laughs> but yeah, this is really nice gunpowder, everything. It's. How many? Tears again seven. Yeah, he made uh, last time I saw seven tears. Now this is a ten tier, so that's don't you. There, I will shoot you, Vanny. I am not afraid. I got it. my arrows cocked and everything. I will shoot you, Vanny. Stop looking down at me. And you can even hear the mobs inside dropping.
So this is exactly like the one I had back on season two. And I mean, if we break, let me see real quick. Ah, nope, I didn't get it. Yeah, um, if you can see all the way down there, mobs will be dropping constantly from this. So, this is just a beautiful spawner, just to make in general. Um, so, you see the little spawning pads in there, half slabs, to keep other stuff from spawning, I think like spiders and stuff, because, hey, hey. I will punch you right off, right off the edge. No, 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 no. Oh, you. find my spread out stuff <laughs> I guess it's kind of revenge for him dying constantly while making the thing But as people start building uh, their respective places and everything, when they start to go out from another, uh, you'll be able to, I'll be able to showcase a little bit more of their buildings and stuff. So, well, there's an axe here, a bow, some pants, some torches, a sword. I had some good stuff on me, Vanny. I hate you. A fence. Oh, if that's great stuff laying on the fire. Okay, I got the suffering and my sharpness looting. New one that I made. Um I think the rest of the stuff is up top. Not too sure. Arrows. Get some carrots in our system. Okay, it's in the chest. I don't remember having gravel, but sure. I'll take gravel. Gravel's nice. Um, okay, so we got all the swords. And pick. I really didn't care about the pick. Um, you get my bow. Okay. Put that in there. And thanks for the amazing footage. <laughs> so I want to thank all my viewers again for watching the videos. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. I saw it, I can't, couldn't tell him in time. <laughs> I tried, guys. I tried. No. No. Also, uh, the reason why he built it at that height up there is because it does not get affected by 
mobs down here or anything. That's why you guys saw so many things dropping. Whereas my mob dropper was affected by that because it wasn't at build height. Um, I'm just going to go around lighting this place up. Maybe especially because I was still <laughs> recording. There we go. Okay, that's all my torches. So this place is a little bit safer. Um, dude, zam Zambles. Creeper. 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 You know what they should add to Minecraft? If a creeper gets hit with like flame or something, it'll blow up still considering it's an explosive. I think that'd be pretty cool. But that's it for this episode guys. I hope you enjoyed. This is your ever lovable This is your ever lovable Freezy Gamer signing out. Say bye to the YouTube. No, I'm not gonna write that. Alright, bye guys. Don't forget to comment, like, subscribe.